So we're still going. What do you reckon the chances are? Three quarters to somebody? What? You reckon you're going to get it? Yeah. Alright. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Here's some footage I took from the weekend where I was running the Dow 5046 props uh, thanks to FPV Doug. Managed to actually get them on my 6 inch frame for a good run. Um, I really like these actually. Uh, the speed um, and the overall control that I had with these props on was, was excellent. Um, found they had a lot of cornering grip as well. And they produced uh, very, very little prop wash, um, even though, you know. Typically, the the six-inch uh, props that I run on here didn't don't normally produce them either, um, so I was quite I was quite quite pleased with that. Whilst I was playing around, though, um, Young Z turned up and decided that he would try a set of my six-inch props on his stretched X five-inch frame. So, yep, just let that sink in for a, a moment. Let's go have a look and see how that went down. Young Z, mate, yeah. what's going on there? Oh, this is the new hype XL. 6 inch overlap. So this is a 5 inch XL frame yep. that you're running 6 inch props on. Yeah, and how do you do that? Yes, FPV mods with a prop spacer. Awesome, so you've got a prop wow. spacer on here so to, so to adjust the height of the props. Mate, that's the new yeah. hype right there, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, XL overlap. How's it fly? Amazing. Yeah? Yeah. Flies like a 6 inch on a 5 inch frame? Yeah, exactly. Ah, oh, see? A, what a money saving, money saving. I'm all about money saving here. Yeah? Yeah. See? Savagery. Oh, legit. Mate, you're just ghetto <laughs> AF. No, this is legit. You're just jealous. And you're in the you're in the same on the front, yeah? Yeah. Offset, offset. So, oh, offset, yeah, okay. So this one is uh, up, this one's spaced, and then I run the opposite. Sweet. <laughs> Alright, well there you go, you heard it here first. <laughs> yeah. XL Five inch right. XL, six inch spacer frame is the way to go. At this point, He'd realised that the props were touching probably a little bit too much than they uh, than they ought to be, so what he did was trim down the tips of the props, made sure that they were only touching very slightly, and decided to go and give it a whirl. So let's see how that went. Get just that. Don't fly. <laughs> Sounds good, mate. Yeah. Sounds like awesome. It's like a rotary. It's just backfire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> it's sounding really good. People talk about having rocks in their motors. The fact that it's flying. Nice landing, bro. <laughs> Let's check out these props, eh? See, they're fine. Too bad. Yeah, oh, blah, yeah blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it's just self molding. Mm. Yeah, see? Blah, 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 blah. It's like race flight, it loses flight. Yeah, yeah, see? Blah, 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 blah. Auto, auto, uh, auto balancing, auto yeah. trimming. It's pretty hot, it's pretty hot, the motor's pretty hot. But it's all good, you know, it's all part of it. It's analog auto trim. Yeah. Yeah, see? <laughs> Sweet. Six inch overlap. Young ZFPV does it again. Thanks for watching guys, please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.